What's going on, you two modeling community? Pappy here at West Georgia Rides and Customs. I've been waiting anxiously to announce this uh, to the uh, YouTube modeling community. Those of you that are participating in the 2023 NASCAR group bill, I've been really kidding. I've been looking forward to this group bill for a while. When Jeff over at Jeff's Model Garage asked me if I would be interested in co-hosting uh, this group bill with him, I was like, shoot you, yeah, man. Let's, let's do this. So uh, we started... Uh, we started the uh, started it up on YouTube as well as we've carried it over to the Facebook group also. So if you're on Facebook, uh, you can post things there as well as here on YouTube. Uh, the uh, it starts February the fifth, which is next weekend. Uh, you can start uploading your build. Or you can actually even start building February the fifth, and it runs through uh, November, I believe, all the way through. It's the entire NASCAR season. We're coinciding this build. Uh, with the theme, one of the themes with uh, from the Acme uh, show for November, uh, which is uh, 75 years of NASCAR, uh, which is, uh, if you look back and you can pick any kind, it just it can't be a snap kit. That's the drawback. We don't want anybody, because there's a lot of snap kits out there. It's not, <laughs> they're not uh, bending the rules for me because every now and then I'll build a snap kit. But uh, uh, snap kit, there's a lot of snap kits out there that you can have that thing built over overnight. It's got stickers on it. It don't have decals. And uh, we want everyone to have a good time, but we want everybody to put some uh, effort into their bills and really uh, pull out your A game on these guys. Uh, there's going to be, there's a lot of, uh, a lot of builders out there that have picked just some awesome kits that they're going, I can't wait to see what they're doing. That's one of the reasons why I kind of uh, procrastinated before I announced mine. I wanted to see what everyone else was building. Uh, I've seen everything uh, posted from, you know, the 60s, the 70s. Hey, I think I, I think somebody's building one out of the 50s. So, uh, you know, there's, but they're all the way up into the new generation cars that are on the track. It seems that, you know, with the, uh, uh, one of the reasons why we're uh, starting this is, uh, you know, to coincide with Speed Weeks, uh, the starting of Speed Weeks at Daytona, as well as with the, uh, you know, the entire season. You got all season to build one. If you want to build one, you want to build two. Hey, the more the merrier. The more, the more content that gets out there, man. We it's just great to see everybody bring some interest back to NASCAR. Uh, it seems like the popularity of NASCAR has been kind of, uh, you know, kind of been going down because, you know, a lot of the political uh, cars are just, you know, they're just mundane now. And uh, I remember, uh, you know, back in the day when, you know, when the, you know, all the, all the big teams were, you know, you just couldn't wait to see what they were putting out on the track each week, each, you know, speed week and seeing what they were bringing, you know, to the table to race that, uh, that week at Daytona. So that's one of the reasons why we're kind of coinciding, you know, the start of that with Speed Weeks at Daytona and ending it up and, you know, kind of running parallel with uh, the Acme theme. And you, anybody that's coming to the Acme show in November of this year, uh, bring those builds along with you. We'll all set them up on the table and that'll, uh, there's going to be a big NASCAR Acme, uh, Acme theme. So bring those in as well if you're coming to the Acme show in November. So I've been kind of watching, seeing what everybody's been building, and I kind of wanted to. Uh, I had some. Uh, I had some picked out that I was going to build in case if I couldn't find this. I waited until I went to the uh, Hope It Don't Snow last weekend in uh, Spartanburg, South Carolina, and I found this kit. I was looking for it, and I uh, decided, yep, this is the one that I'm going to buy, and this is the one I'm going to build. <clears throat> this is the uh, AMT. Coors, Bill Elliott, Ford Thunderbird. This is the one that he drove during the 88-89 season when he won the championships. And uh, I got this. I'm waiting on the uh, I'm waiting on the power slide decals to come in for this. I would rather use some power slide uh, decals and then have these other decals in reserve in case. I always like using power slide. They work great. They're tough. You can clear over them. You can do just about anything with them. Uh, that you're trying to do with your bill. So uh, I'm waiting on those to come in. What, uh, uh, got those ordered from Model Roundup. And uh, we'll be getting those in, in the stash uh, here probably next, uh, probably hopefully by the end of the week. And then uh, maybe next weekend, next Sunday, might crack this box open, get started on it. But uh, hope everybody is uh, uh, putting – you know, put some thought into this. Man, this is, this is back when, you know, when NASCAR was – 
you know, th- this is when NASCAR was NASCAR as far as what I'm concerned. Everybody, uh, the, you had great paint, you know, paint schemes, uh, great sponsorships, uh, great drivers. I mean, I'm not saying I'm not discrediting crediting the drivers that are out there today, but I'm here to tell you to watch oh, Awesome Bill from Dawsonville and, and Dale Sr., uh, any of the Allison's drive back during the day, <laughs> they came to race. They came to win. That's when Rubin was racing. And uh, not kind of like, you know, not like what's going on right now with, with NASCAR. I think that's where we've all kind of lost interest. And they've kind of, they've gotten away from it being a stock car. These are not stock. There's nothing stock about the cars that they're racing right now. They're just making them more even and uh, thinking that they're making it more competitive. But uh, they're, back then they raced from flag to flag and they didn't have, you know, they didn't have quarters or, you know, they wouldn't race in, <laughs> they, the, it, like I say, it's just not racing to me. This is what racing was all about. But I've really been enjoying everyone's uh, uh, entry videos for what they've been doing, but this is the one that I'll be building and uh, can't wait to really get this thing cracked open. I've already opened it up and I'll show everybody everything's still bagged and tagged. So just the awesome uh, AMT kits uh, that that they uh, used to uh, that they used to put out. Everything's still bagged and everything. So looking forward to uh, getting started on this bad boy. So, but more to come on that. Can't wait to see if you're not a uh, if you if you're you know a subscriber to YouTube, post upload your video of uh, what you're going to build. Get started on it after next Sunday the fifth. And uh, also if you're on Facebook, go to your face our. Uh, Facebook page, uh, the 2023 NASCAR group bill hosted by myself and old ferret boy over there at Jeff's modeling garage. Anyhow, y'all have fun with this. Can't wait to see what everybody, uh, puts out there on the bench. And remember guys, if you can dream it, build it. God bless y'all. Pappy out of here.